is Sapphire Needles. Thank you so much for stopping by. Today we'll be um, making this dress. Yeah, it's an illusion dress. Um, I'll be showing you how to draft the pattern and whatnot. If this sounds like what you like, please keep watching. And if you've not subscribed, don't forget to subscribe and click on the notification bell so you get a notification every time I post a video. And if you like it, please give me a thumbs up. Thank you. I've already placed the measurement. This is my shoulder. This is the neck line, the armhole, the bust point, under bust, waist, and the hip. Um, if you don't know how to make a body's look, Please check my I posted a video on that. The bust pan, which is also nipple to nipple, is 4.5. So I'll just go ahead and place it right there. I'll join it from the um, bust line down to the hip. one inch on this on both sides so this is the waist one inch one inch for the under bust i'm taking 1.5 on this side and one inch here this is the bust line i'll come down by one inch now just connect it Connect it to that one inch on the this and this. I'll go ahead to blend it. Now. Okay, I'll come up on the hip line by two inches, then I'll connect it as well. That point. Now this, I'll be making the princess that's here. This is what I'm going to do. I'm going to figure out the midpoint on the armhole. This is the midpoint. Now I'm going to connect it to the first. Yeah, so here I connect it like this. There's an illusion um, part at the center, but it's not going to be deep. We're going to stop it on the bust line, so I'll just connect it to this point as well. I'll come in by half an inch, I'll come in here by half an inch, and I'll connect it to this point. The bust is 44, that's 11, 11, yeah. The under bust is 36, 36 by 4, that's 9, and I took 1 and half here, that's 10 and half, no, 1 and half. And one and a half, yeah. So that's two and a half. So nine plus two and a half, that's 11.5. On the waistline, I took one one inch, and the waist circumference is 40. So that's 10 plus one one two. That's 12. 12. The hip is 50, which is 12.5. 12.5. I'll just extend my line. 12.5. And this, the length of this um, pattern paper is actually 
the desired length. So I'll take 12.5 down as well. 12.5. by um, 2 inches because I want it to stick to the body I want it to be a pen I want it to be pencil so I'm just going by 2 inches 2 inches take my time Out, so we'll see what it looks like. We are done. This is not measurement. I'll just put, um, I'll just use about maybe one inch or one and a half because the fabric is a bit stretchy. One and a half, one and a half. Here is what we're working with. This part is going to be the um, illusion. This is where I'll put the net, and this is where I'll be using the stretch fabric. These are the fabrics I'm working with. I'll be working with this and this. Yeah, so let's cut a pattern if and see what we have. Because I'm going to be cutting it separately, it's not a full dress like the back. The back is just simple. I'm going to be doing the front separate. When I mean when I say separate, I mean I'll be making the half length and I'm making the skirts separately. And here, I'm going to cut this out. Remember, I already re um, replaced the dots in the measurements. to put this on my fabric I just label that this is for the net and this is for the nude fabric there's three pieces so I'll pin it down on the fabric then cut it here I'm just cutting out the fabric for each of the pattern piece on the back pattern remember we did just the front, let's look on the back pattern now. Remember how I told you how to eliminate the zipper bolts for this back pattern? This is the waist and left 2 inch allowance for the zipper. I'll go in by one to the neckline, connect it to this point and bring it back. I'll be placing the back measurements 
this part i'm going to cut off that part where i marked so i'll be placing um this is 11 that's 44 i won't be putting my um, sewing allowance on this pattern because it will not accommodate it but i'll be able to put it on the fabric i'll go down to the hip uh, i'm going to be starting from that line to place my dots and the measurement of this dress so i'll just place the measurement there and then i'll do the same on the um, dress length on the hemline and i'll go in by two inches because i want it to be a pencil dress now I'll just connect the lines
Here I'm cutting out the net for the back pattern because I already cut out the um, fabric, the stretchy fabric. So now I'm just going ahead to cut the net. It's going to be the same thing as the fabric because it's one piece. Yeah, that's it right there. Now just go ahead and cut out the net for the sleeve and every piece of the front pattern. You know this center piece that. Um, just going to be the the usual net. You'll be cutting two pieces, so that's why I put times two on it. The part that has the neck. So here are all the pieces I've cut out to make this dress. In the next video, I'll be showing us how to sew it and attach the lace. Thank you. Bye.